Welcome to the battle at the River Trebia. Hannibal and his Carthaginian armies, including elephants, versus a Roman legion led by some Roman guy that no one really cares about, but slightly differently today. Today, it is going to be an AI-only battle. That's right, I am not getting involved at all. Medium difficulty, AI Carthage versus AI Rome at the River Trebia. Who is going to win? Let's find out. Here we go. Hannibal getting to the front. Oh, what are we doing with? I'm a bit worried. I don't know how smart the AI is going to be or maybe not smart. The Cav coming on the flank. I can't get involved in any way. Hannibal, what are you doing? Oh, God, no. Hannibal, no. <laughs> well, the Cav hit on the flank anyway. Uh, they should be able to destroy them. They've got more cavalry coming in. Uh, the phalanxes are coming, the elephant's staying back, but Hannibal's straight on in there, he's got cavalry reinforcements. If we can get his infantry and the elephants in, maybe have the cav flank, he might be able to make something out of this, but he's losing bodyguards. He needs to get those elephants and cav in there now. He needs to be quick. Right, he broke that cav unit, come on. Big cav charge in the back right here. Oh, he's down to two. This is not good. Cav charge plus elephants. It's medium difficulty. Their morale is the same as Carthage's. They can do it. They can get the win here. Come on. Come on. You need to get the cavalry in for... Oh, no. Oh, no. The elephants are gone. They're not berserk, but they are fleeing. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. The Romans just pushing on past. Hannibal's still alive. The Carthaginians broke one unit of Velites. Come on, get the cavalry in here. Hannibal's still alive. Take advantage of it. And he broke out the wrong second. He's charging back on in. The Cav do arrive, but it's it's too late. The other Carthaginians, the sacred band, has collapsed. If they had five more seconds. If he had five more seconds, I think he could have done it. And there Hannibal goes. Oh, that was a, a real shame. The elephants have returned onto the field, but yeah, everyone else has broken. Hannibal's returned as well, but there's nothing he can do. The battle, I think it's over. The Romans have the win. That guy went flying. <laughs> Elephants can get a lot of kills though. We'll see how they do with them, but I can't see them turning it around. Not after that. Yeah, they're already breaking. And yeah, with that, that's it. Hannibal just stood here right in the middle of the battlefield. Uh, gone slightly crazy. He's just waiting for someone to kill him, but nobody cares. <laughs> oh, in come the Triarii. They, they should chill it. Yeah, go on, kill him. I wanted Carthage to win, as, you know, they're usually played by the human player. I saw them as being the underdog in this battle, but, oh wow. Is he gonna die, though, or is he actually going to escape with his life? Ah, I think he's going to get away. Unless he charges right back on into the enemy. Oh, don't be even stupid, Hannibal. <laughs> it didn't work for the first time, it's not gonna work for the second time. I think he got away. And there we go, Hannibal, he did get 506 kills, but he was vastly outnumbered in that battle. But I really do think he could have got the win. If his, if the general unit did not rout, if the elephants did not rout, and the cav charged into the back, they were doing, but they took their time a little bit. They could have, you know, surrounded the Romans completely and broke them. You've got to remember, if you play battles on very hard difficulty, your opponents get plus 10 morale as opposed to normal difficulty. Or something like that, something along those lines. Plus 10, plus 7, it's around there. So yeah, normal difficulty, take that away from what you're used to. I think they could have done it, and that would have been half of Rome's army gone. 
Yeah, it wasn't the strength because they did get an impressive amount of kills, uh, considering how vastly outnumbered they were. Wow, that was actually fun to watch. Let's try another. Okay, so I wanted to try the Battle of Cynocephali. Uh, we have the Romans under the Scipii banner. Some good has start here, Triarii, uh, Mercenary Peltus, what do we have on the flank? Ooh, a unit of Principes as well. Uh, the general in the middle, uh, Triarii, more Hastati, some good phalanxes, uh, more Triarii, and ten elephant units. Funny looking ten, no, it's four elephant units. Fighting in Macedonian land versus the Macedonians. Uh, what have they brought? So we got some heavy cav here, uh, some phalanxes, some Thracian mercenaries on the high ground. And then the other part of the army is on this side. The general, some more light cav, some phalan phalanxes. Yeah, just long line of phalanxes and, yeah, peltists. Alright then, let's see how AI Rome does. Even balance of power yet again. Can the Romans do it? Can they get the win here? Again, medium difficulty, so it is fair on both sides. Elephants going in first, that's the opening. Done, uh, going to get charged by the cav though. Yeah, that's a bit of a waste of elephants, I think. Yeah, they're already losing troops. Uh, if they can get the Triaria unit to charge in the back though. But yes, yes, they are going for it. It's smarter than I thought. Right, they should be able to break them easily. With the elephants as well causing fear. Uh, battle hasn't started there yet. Ah, oh, but they're gonna get hit in, in the side and by the Thracian mercenaries as well. Very high attack, they got a good charge on as well. That was a big shame. I think they're going to lose on this front. Yeah, I don't think they have enough. Oh, saying that, the Macedonian Cav did break. Is that enough to break the others? With these reinforcements here, I think it could be. Oh, they're gonna throw the peeler first. The Thracians broke. More Macedonian Cav broke from the flank. And the Romans charging in into the front of a phalanx with Peltus for some reason. Uh, but the strategy everywhere else has been quite good. <laughs> Don't know what all that was about. Yeah, they should win on this front now. And then that should be more reinforcements on this side. They need to kill the general there. Where's their general? Keeping him back, keeping him safe. Good. Good, I like to see that. Unlike what Hannibal did. Just charge on right in there. <laughs> Dumb Hannibal. He never knew anything about strategy. Can the Romans do this one bar? They won on this flank. On this side, it's a little bit more even. I'd say right now though, in favour of Macedon, and the balance of power does agree. They're gonna have to put up some impressive strategy if they want to win this, and they're gonna lose another Hastati unit to the Cav Charge, which they don't seem to be responding to at all. Have the elephants gone berserk? They have, and they're all killing each other. No, oh, that was not good for the Romans. Massive balance of power drop right there, and they're using their Triaria unit to charge uh, to chase down the Macedonians. No, that's not what they wanted. That's not what they should have done. If they use the general well though and kill the enemy general, they might be able to make something out of this. Unlikely, but I think it might be possible again. But I don't think we're going to even see that. They're trying to throw in the peel, they're not going to get many kills there. Look at all the dead Romans compared to the Macedonians. Yeah, Rome got slaughtered on that first wave. They're fighting the phalanx, and the phalanx didn't go down in time, which is good for the Scipii. It's only Triarii. And now the Roman general charges in, but gets caught on the phalanx as well. Ah, I don't, I don't, I don't see him winning this now, even if they do manage to kill the general. I don't see him doing it. Elephants still berserk. Are they still chasing them down with the Triarii? Yeah, they are. Very tired as well. Big mistake by the Romans. Ah, I thought for a second I thought they could have had it. I thought they could have won that battle. The Macedonians vote their general down to three. The Roman general at 30. If the Romans can work with anything right now, it will be that. Can they do anything to the general? I doubt it, the general's just pacing around, untouched right now. 
Yeah, no one seems to be able to get at him. More Romans breaking. Surely these are going to break as well. <laughs> this is the dumbest fighting I've ever seen. <laughs> Neither unit is interested. <laughs> Na these guys aren't interested. These Romans don't seem to care. They just... They just look as if they want to die. <laughs> How's the phalanx battle going over here? Terribly. Just completely terribly. What's the Roman general doing? I don't know. Come on, AI, wake up. They have managed to uh, get the Macedonians on two sides here. Uh, sort of. If they can attack with their troops. And there we go. The Romans all starting to collapse. It is just the general left now. Oh, and the little berserk elephant. <laughs> just running in the background. Yeah, by the way, some units do break and then return, and they are out of AI only mode. Nothing I can do about that. There we go. To be honest, if, if a faction reaches this stage here, they're dead anyway. So I, it still is fair. Wait, we got a Triari unit all the way over here. It's coming back. <laughs> At last, completely exhausted though. <laughs> Ah, uh, if I just... Uh, I think they had potential again, but not as much potential as Hannibal had. And there we go. They weren't as outnumbered, but that time, you know, the, the AI army, or, you know, the human army, the army that should be controlled by humans, I'll call it, did not perform that well in that battle. Yeah, compared to the Macedonian troops. General though, getting 193 kills. But yeah, that elephant's going berserk. Don't know why that happened, but that was a massive loss. Okay, but we are back, and this time I'm trying it again, but on easy difficulty. This means that the Carthaginian army does have an advantage against the Romans. They were close to winning this one. I think they had potential, so let's make the difficulty easier for them. They're going to do the same strategy again, of course, but... Let's see if we can get the win this time. Will it be enough? What is it? Is it like an extra 7 melee attack or se 7 defense on their troops? And an extra 7 morale or something? I think it's something like that. Uh, the Cav not engaging this time, but Hannibal, yeah, he's going in yet again. Ooh, losing bodyguards even quicker this time, which I did not expect. But he's got Cav reinforcements here. What are the elephants going to do? Come on. Come on, Carthage, you can do it this time. They're just leading the cavalry away with a, mi with a missile cav, which d does kind of work for them. It gives them another cav unit on the main uh, battlefield early, but they need to charge in. They need to get out of that stupid patrol or whatever they're doing. Go, charge on in there. The Carthaginians getting surrounded. They've got their elephants. They're trying to break through the ranks with the elephants. Ah, but Triarii going for the cavalry. No, that's not good. But they've lost their militia cav. They did their job, they distracted them. The Romans trying to take the high ground. It's all going to be decided here. Can the elephants hold? Can Hannibal survive? Where is the Roman general? Oh, the elephants have gone berserk. At least they've gone berserk into, into the Roman troops this time, though. I guess that's a good sign. Hannibal, what's he doing? He's charging for the Triarii. Oh, the Cav got caught, and they didn't even get a charge in. Hannibal charges on in, and he dies on the Triarii. What an idiot. <laughs> and now all of his troops are going to break, and battle over. Well done, Hannibal. Even with advantages, you couldn't win at Trebia. Oh, if, an if anything, though, it just it goes to show how difficult these historical battles are. <laughs> how difficult they made them. Because... Even if you play AI versus AI, so they're both even, and give the one that should have been human, the playable one, extra advantages of having it on easy difficulty, they still lose. Which I think says quite a lot about the real difficulty of the historical battles on the older titles. Anyway, there we go, it's over. They did better. They got more kills that time. Anyway, let me know if you did like this idea. If you did, please do like the video, or share with anyone else you think may be interested. 
600 likes, and I'll do one for the Tutor Bird Forest. I think that could be very interesting. How well will the AI respond to being ambushed in the German forest? And I think I'll try Farcelus as well. If the idea continues to be popular, I'll try it for Medieval 2 as well. I think an AI Agincourt could be quite interesting. Let me know. Hope you enjoyed, but for now, until the next one, tomorrow's video, goodbye.